Estimation is an important life skill, and as adults we use it on almost a daily basis. In fact, making a correct estimation in an emergency situation can be extremely critical. So what is estimation? Well, according to the dictionary, the term estimation can refer to a personal opinion. It can also refer to a rough calculation. In this video, we're going to look at estimation as a rough calculation. In mathematics, to make an estimation is to try to determine the nearest true value of something based on simple facts and figures that are readily available. In other words, estimation is taking a calculated guess or making a rough calculation. When we make an estimation, we simply want to have a close idea of what something measures or what its true value is. So, for example, do you have a close idea of how much food you throw away every month? Or how about how much time you spend on your mobile phone every day? Well, we usually make estimations when we don't have enough time, information or skills needed to determine the actual true value of whatever it is we are interested in. And that's why we rely on simple facts and figures that are readily available to help us determine the nearest true value. So did you know the world's population in 2015 was estimated to be 7.3 billion and is expected to rise to 9.8 billion by 2050? Now those are large numbers. But in any case, World's population estimates cannot tell us the actual true number of people alive on our planet at this very moment, but they do give us the nearest true value based on simple facts and figures available from sources like national birth records, death records and national census data. So here's something for you to try. Imagine you've been asked to take part in the London Marathon next year. It's about 42 kilometers in distance, or 26.2 miles. The route is mostly flat ground along the River Thames through various towns and high streets. Some of the world's best runners have completed it in just over three hours. But it usually takes you 20 to 25 minutes just to walk one mile to your local post office. So given these facts and figures, can you give an estimation of how long it would take you to walk the London Marathon? Okay, I'll give you some time to work that out, but if you get anything less than 8 hours, then you're not doing too bad. Okay, so what is estimation? Well, we've seen in mathematics to make an estimation is to try to determine the nearest true value of something based on simple facts and figures that are readily available. In other words, estimation is taking a calculated guess for making a rough calculation. Well, I hope you found this helpful. Thanks for watching.